to you. <laughs> I said that I would never do. <laughs> Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, and to another edition of the Nameless Podcast, because this fucking guy hasn't came up with a name yet. I came up with a name for it once. Really? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I guess our Nameless Podcast is, remains nameless, then. I was going to name it the Keith's... Said he was gonna buy a new microphone for his computer and he's fucking in denial. No, about dude! It. <laughs> no, you, no, no, it, no! Stop! We, we argued about this la- before the podcast last week. Fuck! All right. Well, as always, I'm your fucking humble host, Brandon Brogan, and with humble. me as always, I'm humble. What? <laughs> How are you the fucking humble? I eat fucking humble pie. That's I'm so fat. <laughs> you need some more. Aww. <laughs> and this is, as always, I guess, my fucking co-host and hello, hetero, hetero hello. sometimes hetero oh, life partner, yeah. uh, Keith Morris. Yeah, I got a new iPhone. Look at this thing. Yeah, you got it's the gold. Gold my grill, son. Don't put that iPhone in your mouth. Okay. Is there an app for that? <laughs> <laughs> no, this one for your butt, though. Is there like a fucking sweet iPhone app where you can hold it up in front of your mouth and it makes it look like you have a gold grill? Because I bet there probably I is. I want one. <laughs> if, if there is... If there is, somebody let me know, because I want one. Yeah, and definitely you should probably get a fart button. Can you even get this? Yeah, the, the really? really rampant. Or the mic. Uh, <laughs> you need like, to get the this... DMX soundboard, so then when we're going, is, you're is like, one? come on, come on! <laughs> <laughs> what? Ar, ar, ar. <laughs> Dude, is that a real thing? Like, is that a... <laughs> Dude, that's probably, come, come on. on. That has to be Let's find Wait, wait. Out. Come what? on! It has to be real. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, there might be, really. I guess there should be kind of probably one for everybody. Yeah, but DMX especially, because whatever they're making his album, they have it. What? What? What's this say? Okay, that's not a soundboard. Yeah, that's just like samples from the songs. These bastards. It's a rip. Uh, Let's try this one. The rap board. Wait, is this like a, a message board? Oh no, dude. It's a soundboard with like all rappers. Oh, nice. Like everything they say, let's see what this... Let's see what two chains says. That's pretty accurate. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> 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 yeah, special guest fucking podcast, two chains. Big boy. It looks like Yo Yo's brother with like it, glasses yeah, on. Yeah, it's uh, from from Outcast, dude. What? Nah. Ooh, Birdman. One <laughs> hundred. <laughs> One hundred. <laughs> Where's Manny Fresh? Whoop whoop. It's bullshit. I see Busta. Wait, it's Busta Bus. It, I think it's an. Oh, wait, I was gonna say it's alphabetical, but black people don't put it in alphabetical. Well, it is because it's Birdman then Busta Bust, so Busta's down here. Oh, so Manny Fresh should be way down here. Hey, there's a lot of Wheezy. Yeah. Fuck, I bet where's Manny? Hey, ODB, dude. Yeah. Oh shit. Timmy, Timmy, yo, yo, yo. <laughs> They didn't take this one off Pitbull. Pitbull fucking sucks. That guy's a rapper? I know. I didn't think he rapped. Will Smith? What? Look at this guy. He's white as fuck. I know. He's the whitest rapper on this board. I think he might be a Cunningham. Ooh. Probably. <laughs> nah, they're pretty white. Mm. <laughs> mm. I'm having sex. Mm. Yeah, having gay sex mm. with Will Smith mm. right now on the podcast. Mm. 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 <laughs> yeah. Mm. <laughs> Who some of these people are? Rick Ross. Woo. Ricky Ross. 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 Hey, he stole that sound clip from me. Yeah. <laughs> Snoop. Big Snoop D O Dub. Blood out. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> <laughs> then we did that Blood Out one for what? Yeah, I know. That's right. <laughs> Who's Mop? M O P? I don't know. Still. I down, I say. I was about to say, if they didn't have him saying his own name, then that's bullshit. That's Mike Jones' the only claim. I don't claim. see Manny Fresh. I don't either, dude. That's kind of bullshit. Well, he'd be up higher, right? He'd be right after Wheezy. There's Luda. Wait, is that Manny? Yeah, Manny. He's got two. Ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Yeah. I guess I'll have to suffice. Dude, Lloyd Banks has a huge upper lip, for the record. Like, I, every, every, every time, like... Like, uh, some fat girl or some, like, unattractive girl wants to get up on, I'm just like, I just want to be like, can't touch this, and, like, have the whole fucking song just start playing. <laughs> it's like, crab dance everyone? Like, oh, 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 can't touch this. 
Juicy. Have you heard that Katy Perry song, by the way? Yeah. Juicy J ruins that song, to be honest with you. Juicy J is not It good. has a good beat. And, like, I don't, her, like, I don't care what she says. It just, like, fits the music. But, like, Juicy J comes in and just makes the song fucking terrible. Bad. Let's hear the Lil Wayne ones. All right. What we got? Where is, why is he wearing a Boston hat? It should be, like... Okay, okay, okay. That's not Lil Wayne. I know. Okay. He's even auto tuned on his soundboard. He's auto tuned. He, he's just auto tuned in real life. He swallowed a yeah. tiny computer. Yeah, that's actually pretty sweet. <laughs> it's just a lot of woos and E40. <laughs> that's you. Ghost ride the whip. Ghost ride the whip. I want to go to ride the whip. That'd Dude, is sweet. there fucking what's his nuts? Uh, Look, Gucci? Is Gucci on there? Yeah, boy. Gucci mine, right there. Dude, there's fucking Easy E. Up, oh. where? Okay, where in the fucking ghost face? At? That guy. That's him. <laughs> <laughs> right there, dude. The socks at. Dude, it exists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That last one is in the woo. Oh, woo! Drake and DMX fucking. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Joey Crack, put him up, family. Yeah, where's ICP at? Where's Violet J? There's no white people on here, though. Is that them? Oh, who's this guy? Uh, Action Bronson, who the fuck is that? I don't fucking know. Yeah. Is anybody who knew Action Bronson is? Why am I talking to a camera that doesn't talk back to me? I don't know. Well, maybe somebody will post a comment on a video for once. That's pretty. It's 50. 8K A Ferrari F50. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. She got a big booty, so I call her Big Booty. Who's Chief Keef? Is he good? No. He's but I know who he is. Busta. Busta. Yeah. <laughs> Big Sean has a lot. He's even good. Hey, everyone else just says ass. <laughs> ass, ass. Oh, yay, yay. From the hood. I feel like I'm a real gangster at this point. I, I know. Need, I need some, like, glasses like that to make me look more gangster. Kanye glasses make you look gangster? Yeah. From the hood, dude. From the streets, bitch. Is he... What is what is Pitbull? He's Mexican, I think. I think so. Like Latino of some sort. Yeah. Wiz? He's just gonna be like, ha ha ha. Jesus. Jesus is getting it good uh, from Wiz. Uh, good Google Good Google Who's Project Pat. Chicken head. Whoop, whoop, chicken, chicken, whoop, Never. whoop, chicken head. I have no, no. idea who that is. Is he your Go outside and rap gang. Bang, bang, bang. I'm going to put that in my, we should put that in our live song. Like when we play Live at Warped Tour this year, we should just have like, like. Go outside and rap gang. Bang, And then we come on to that. And then, then we come Wait, that's the, the intro? Yeah. <laughs> and then the dog walks out of stage. And there's like a, there's like a, bass. there's like some kind of sick rap beat. Dude, I was at the gym today. Segwaying into some unrelated topic completely. Like, they're playing slow jams at the gym this morning. And I was like, what? Slow jams is baby making music, not weight making music. I know, that's what I thought. I was like, am I supposed to just start, start having sex with this weight bench or something? Did you throw like, it down? At least? Well, I started humping it, but it looked awkward. I was like, like, I'm doing butterfly curls. He's like, <laughs> yeah. Instead of laying on my back, I'm just like hammering. I'm like, eh, eh, eh. like MacGruber style. Like, eh, 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 eh. Then I was like, I thought that was Missy Elliott. I did too. Debra got fat. Sorry, girl. Nah, she's the fat now. <laughs> she's the. <laughs> she's a huge lesbian too. Really, Debra? Yeah. Come on. But which is awesome because that does like segue right into our topic for tonight. Yeah. The brat is a huge lesbian. That's our topic. Wait, no wait. Our topic tonight is actually <laughs> is actually lesbians in general, not just the brat. She can eat all the muff she wants. I don't understand butchy lesbians. Like, what's the point? Like, they dress up like a 
like a dude and act like a guy and everything. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, mm-hmm. isn't isn't the whole thing you don't want to be dating someone that looks like a guy? Well, they're not penis? dating. Butchers but, don't date other butchers usually. I know, but they date like a girl that looks like a girl. So why isn't the girl who's a girly girl dating a dude instead of just a butch? I don't understand that. Because guys are assholes, Keith. Don't you know? But girls like guys that are assholes. Yeah, it's true. It's so, a very, it's a, it's a never ending conundrum. So I don't understand. understand. It like, like, me. okay, so I met this girl today who is now a lesbian. Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe bi, I guess. Probably bi. Okay. Since most lesbians are actually bi because who doesn't they like... They just got treated like shit. Who doesn't like a good dick in every now and then? I don't. You've never had a good dick in? Yeah, that's right. You've only had dick in from this guy and yeah. it's never good. <laughs> it's never good. It's, <laughs> it's kind of like disappointing. It's kind of like going to the doctor and getting a shot. Small prick, some slight disappointment. You know, mm-hmm. and you don't get a sucker. At the end. It's all over pretty quick. You might get a sucker at the end. <laughs> a very disappointing sucker, but it's still a sucker nonetheless. Hey man, I'll least, take it. At least I still have all my teeth. Yeah, I I chewed to get into the middle of the sucker the one time. <laughs> that, that didn't end pretty. Yeah, bit right into that fucking tootsie yeah. pop. <laughs> yeah, but I don't understand. So she's like, um, she has a kid with a guy and stuff. Mm-hmm. Obviously, but, because I was. Yeah, she's a kid <laughs> with a guy, and, and but now she's a lesbian, and I was like. Don't fucking touch me. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, she, hey, Tank went live. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get banned. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, I didn't, I didn't really understand, mm-hmm. like, how you just decide one day, like, I'm a lesbian, I don't like peepees anymore. And I was like, how does that work? Well, I can definitely get behind lesbians' mentality. Well, because okay. vagina is a lot better than okay, gay. Okay, yeah, that's pretty fair. It's like, I would rather look, look at uh, the ugliest vagina. I'd rather stare at blue waffles than stare at the prettiest dick there is. Oh, we're watching John Leguizamo. Who the fuck is he? John Leguizamo, dude, he played clown in Spawn. I thought a black guy played Spawn. No, he played Spawn. He played clown. The clown dude. I thought you just said he played Spawn. He played clown in Spawn. Oh. Okay. No, Michael Jai White, which is a black guy, ironically. Black guy named White. But. Okay. That's okay. I get it. <laughs> but, uh. <laughs> Look at this fucking Weezer looking I don't know, dude. You're like Rivers Cuomo. <laughs> All right. But yeah, like lesbians, I, I'll never understand them. You know, like, I, I get it. I get the lesbian mentality because, like, I love vagina too. But, like, a hot chick who shacks up with a dude-looking chick, she might as well just get the dude. I know. How does that make any sense? She dresses like a guy, acts like a guy. I don't understand that. I don't and I'm going to assume dude clothes is more comfortable than girl clothes. Probably. But girls really like wearing that tight-ass shit all the time. So but I will why, tell you that I do they... like getting in girls' pants a lot. But um, chi <laughs> I'm sorry, dog. <laughs> you, you keep the world's roofie supply in high demand. I mean... Yeah, if she comes around me, she can get roofioed and then probably get gang bang a lang gang bang a lang <laughs> There goes ha- our, all of our female viewers. <laughs> we had viewers? I don't know, maybe. Oh. Chelsea, also one of the chicks yeah. that I don't understand. Like, I like Chelsea a lot, but I don't understand. Yeah. She has kids, hey. but she's a lesbian... But I, isn't she dating that one guy? I think she's dating there? a guy, but he might have a vagina. I don't know him, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Prove it. Whip it out. I yeah, guess. I know. Like, cause, like, he wants to see it, I like, guess. Like, as, as a dude, I can barely grow facial hair. So a, a not chick, a very good man. A chick with a lot of facial hair would not surprise me. A chick with facial hair? Yeah. Huh. I mean, we have a whole street gang about chicks with facial hairs, man. You have a gang. Bearded ladies. You're a gang. This is our territory. I'm one man gang. You're a one man gang? Because I weigh 600 pounds. Ooh, that's hot. <laughs> that's three dudes with 200 pounds, or four dudes 150. That makes my wiener chunky. Nice. <laughs> well, you know, you can just get some grease from one of my fat rolls, and we don't even have to use lube. Now you're on to something. <laughs> yeah, that dick. <laughs> oh, you! Hey, but it's the same thing with gay guys, though. What like, if you think about it, they kind of act like chicks, you know? Do they? Yeah, they, they they wear the tight chick-like clothes, and they, like, that's not true. talk like that. Most of the time. I don't really, I guess I don't really know any gay people personally. I actually, don't. actually, no, I do know one gay person. Besides you. Okay. It's like, dude, those things are really good. I know. <laughs> I, I mean, does anyone remember these? They still make those. <laughs> 
Like, like, he went away. Like, <laughs> like, he just disappeared for like years. Like, like, oh, oh, what? There's a lost supply. Kool Aid the jammers. They were in the Titanic. We just discovered the supply. That'd be fucking awesome. Like when they did that beer. What beer? And found all those casks of like Viking beer from like sunken Viking ships. Really? Yeah. And they brought it up and they they. It was like it. stale as fuck. No, I think it was preserved. Really? Yeah. What were we just talking about? Lesbians. Oh, nice. that's the overarching. I topic. like. I like them because they like the same thing I do. Exactly. We can all hang out. I'm digging yeah. it. Like I have a lot in common. I was fucking lesbian. And maybe maybe one day <laughs> maybe one day she's bored and we can bang. Exactly. You know, yeah. you know, you always got the off chance that the she's chick- like my girlfriend is putting out tonight. I'll put out. Yeah. <laughs> like, I think you have a better chance, and, like, and, and like I know this goes without saying, because who cares about the butch lesbians, you know? Like, I don't want to try to bang a butch lesbian. Nope. But no. I think you have a better shot banging a regular, like, a, a pretty girl lesbian, because they're still girly, and they still probably want the dick. Like, I may be completely wrong on this, but I don't know any straight-up lesbians. I've never met a lesbian who hasn't, like, in her past been with a dude. Well, I think they all have to try being with the guy first to see if they even like it. Then they don't like it for Yeah, but reason. I know gay dudes who have never been with a girl. Your eyes are brown and they remind me of dog poop and it really bothers me. Mine's are hazel. <laughs> they're, they're more brown than mine are. Mine are more green than brown. Yours are more brown than green. Stop looking at me like that. <laughs> you're like cross-eyed at me like, <laughs> I'm gonna... I just want you to know right now that keeps checking out my eyes and shit. <laughs> it has to look really hard because I'm pretty squinty. <laughs> What am I supposed to look at? I don't know. My brown eye. Well, I guess you were. (laughs) (laughs) Boot, boot. (laughs) I guess I was. (laughs) I can't help myself. (laughs) I'm just so dude, You're so insatiable. I do like Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome. Mm -hmm. And it is quite the wasteland. Yep. Uh, You don't want to go back there. Ever. All right. Remind me not ever to get behind you and have your back. Aw. Look at that wet pussy. I'm digging it. But here's another thing. Uh-huh. uh-huh. I don't uh, uh-huh. really uh-huh. like lesbian uh-huh. porn. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Lesbian porn just pisses me off. Why? Because I like to see a chick getting railed, man. I only like flaccid penises. Yep. Isn't it like a round white bit? I want to get that so bad. <laughs> do, 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 do. The lost supply of Kool-Aid jammers. Oh, they are so good. Then, then you drink one, it's gone in like one sip, and you're like, I need like a whole fucking case just to satisfy Do you me. remember those like fucking little wax bottles that you used to get on Halloween that were filled with candy? Or filled Dude, with like, are, liquid? And you could chew the wax? Well, you're not supposed to. Really? But you could. Okay, I always did. I, I was always like told you are supposed to chew the I wax. just chew the shit out of the whole bottle. Like, I just, uh, like, yeah. But you're not supposed to. I think you're supposed to break them open. Oh. Well, I could be I wrong. Didn't, I didn't follow the rules. I mean, I know, like, even with Fun Dips, you weren't supposed to do lines of that shit, but, I mean, we did. You have weekends off, don't you? Yeah. And Fridays? Yeah. You're going to come to me with Chicago when I go when I go to the GP in the summer. All right? Okay. Cool. Yeah, I should have uh, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays off all the time. Cool. Just got to clear it with the old lady. Nah, she doesn't care. Punch her face. Do it. Punch my girlfriend in the face. <laughs> Should ask her about that because she was uh, she was a fake ass lesbian for a little bit too. Really? Yeah. When? Uh, who? Was that when she was hanging out with Cassie? No. Oh. That's he's related to Yo-Yo. Yep, definitely. That white guy is definitely related to Yo-Yo. <laughs> Patrick Chapin. <laughs> Chapin. Chapin. I think he wrote a symphony at one point. Yeah. Chopin. 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 Isn't he a comedian? Um, Chapin? Maybe. That one guy? Oh, it's Charlotte Chaplin. Chaplin. And then That's that, completely unreal. And he had like a sweet Hitler mustache before he was a Hitler mustache? Yeah. And then like everybody got offended by that and nobody liked him anymore. Yep. Except people still do. That guy's a racist. I don't like him. The racist? The most racist the motherfucker you've ever seen in your life. Therapist? Huh. That's the... Wow. Diverse field. Look at that. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Sunshine style? Is that what that is? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Tank was doing that the other night, and he didn't. And I was like, "Oh, you watch Shinchan?" And he's like, "What?" And I was like, "You even know what I was talking about?" Damn it! Shinchan is an awesome show. It is. I'm down with that. I wish there was more seasons, just as the first two. That gets our official endorsement of an awesome show that everyone should watch. Thumbs up. <laughs> your booty holes. Yep. Thumbs up your booty holes, like Michael Jack. Oh. Wacko Jacko. 
Do you think his nose really fell off? Uh, they have pictures of it. His and nose it, falling off? And it was on the internet, so I Of his nose it. falling off? I'm gonna see it. Go look at it. Would you look at his Wikipedia page? Michael Jackson was a Christian hardcore band. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but I so I recently discovered that Emma Watson has a badonka dunk. Mm. She has like a fucking banging ass. I'm digging white girls with big asses. It's like fucking like fucking crazy. Let me, like like I said, I've said this a lot of times in my life, and I'll say it again every day until the day I die. Nothing is sadder to me than a fucking hot white girl with a pancake ass. Look at that. Yeah? I didn't realize her ass is that big. I'm digging it, man. I she, thought she, I like I originally thought she had a pancake ass. And then like like these things are like pointed out to me. Like that's even a side view. And like um I don't know, man. And like yeah. I was like, fuck, I didn't realize it. Now she's even hotter to me than she was before. Yeah. But pancake asses, yeah, continue. Yeah, I'm like, like I said, every time I see a white chick with a pancake ass, I want to kick her in her ass and turn into a waffle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but you would bang the shit out of Miley Cyrus. Dude, I would bang the shit out of Miley Cyrus. Here's the question. And by extension, probably also Justin Bieber. I'm just saying, they look alike. So I'd probably Yeah, it's kind of really awkward. I'd probably knock both them boots. Yeah. <laughs> These boots are made for knocking. That's just what they're going to do. But, uh,. Here's a, here's a real question. Girls that act like Miley Cyrus, like all crazy and shit, and do that whole thing, how much of it is an act versus, like, them being really banging in bed or them just laying there and taking it like, I'm such a bad bitch. And then you just, then you get them and, like, they just kind of lay there and don't really do much. And it's yeah. like, this is kind of boring. Chicks who think they're bad bitches think they don't got to put any effort into it. Yeah. And that's a travesty. Yeah. It's, like, kind of, it's kind of lay there and you beat it up. Exactly. And, like, and you know, like, that's all right. And it's but like, I don't mind beating it up, but if that's all, like, we do, that's kind of boring. Exactly. I want chick, I want to fucking go home with, like, scratches. I want to get fucking sweaty and gross. I want to, like, I want my bed to look like fucking a murder happened on it. You know? Like, that's what I want. I don't want, I don't want it to just be, like, her outline and just, like, because my sweat surrounds yeah. it. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I don't... That's, I don't want that, you know? Like, or my, uh, like, then when, like, when I was done, and my dick hurts, I know it was a good time. Mm hmm It's like, my dick hurts, it's like, yeah, yep. that means I fucking did some work. See, because like, I can't even imagine what she feels like then, because, like, I'm just doing this. She's getting punched, pretty much, in the <laughs> fucking vagina by my fucking dick. It might be, like, a little baby hand, but it's still... <laughs> Do they make miniature baby hands? Like, miniature kind of, like, scale model replicas of baby hands? <laughs> like, actual baby, like, this baby is only... No, I mean, I mean, comparatively that to your size with your penis. <laughs> like, replicas of, like, baby hands are, like, smaller than, not the scale of baby hands. <laughs> like a tiny peanut-sized baby baby hand? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's hard, it's hard getting in when you only have a peanut. Yeah. But... Dude, we we rub, manage. I'll just rub it on the outside. I don't care. <laughs> just rub around the lips. Exactly. As long as I get it, you know. <laughs> fuck it. I've put in enough time trying to get chicks off. I think I've earned. I think I've earned a couple of my own. <laughs> then, then you just randomly throw a karate headbutt, on, <laughs> headbutt on oh, the yeah. fucking clip. That's how she knows I was there. <laughs> Look at this guy. Is he benching four plates? This isn't even him. I thought that was gonna be yo-yo benching. Just because he was black. I am disappointed. No, they were laying down at the start of the clip. Oh. Well, you can see his black legs. He 420 for three? For 23 times? That's crazy. You like some dude gets his blood in the shot. Yeah. He's like, yeah. yeah. Oh, he's going to be one of those guys. He's got to yell. He's not even going all the way up. Yo, yo. Yo, yo, he's got bad form. Ah! Look, look how high he's going. He's not even going like all straight arm. I thought they don't count unless you straight arm. Get Come on, Brandon. Like that Get one. Brandon. Yeah. <laughs> scary, scary movie style. Get Brandon. Come on, Brandon. Just having sex with that ball. I know. Why do you have to be Brandon? Come on. Awesome. <laughs> Joni loves Chachi. It really does. Too bad Joni didn't does. love Joni. Then she could be a lesbian, which Dude, is our topic, which we have not talked about really. Haven't we? Kinda. Okay. It's not that interesting because lesbians don't interest me because like they're not on. They're pretty much non non combatants to me. 
Like in the war of getting vagina, lesbians uh-huh. are non combatants mm-hmm, to me. Don't they get in the way? Not really. Because they're going to steal the same girls you are? Yeah. I mean, there is a, a, a so fat chick out there that looks just like me. Dude, that is creepy. And she might the be. Girl, the girl that works at Walmart looks like this fucking guy. And, like, sometimes I want to go up and just be like, hey, Brandon. And What's I'm up? like, wait, that's not Brandon. That's awkward because I was like all rubbing up on her. Like she's she could be my competition. Like if I, if we were both going after the same chick, she I, might... w- I wouldn't know. Maybe she's like you guys are twins and she fucks both of you at the same time. You London Bridge her. How about that? London Bridge? Do you mean Eiffel Tower? What's London Bridge? I don't even know what that is. Isn't that a Fergie thing? She talks about like London bridges and shit. Yeah, but I don't. What's that mean? I don't know. Yeah, that's Fergie. Okay. By her lovely I'm lady loves. I'll wiki, Wikipedia. All right, no, Holy wait, shit. Urban, urban Dictionary, that shit. Yeah? Yeah, you should. What about that? Like, ooh. DJ who can it. it? Urban. Oh, yeah, Mike Will made it. That guy's fucking stupid. That's a stupid name. He has a stupid nickname. Mike Will made it. All right, London Bridge. London Bridge. Uh. That doesn't even say me. Wait. Oh, that means they're making your fucking... Very hot? Your vagina hot? That's like, stupid. Like your panties are going to drop? Now like, type in Eiffel Tower. Okay. I think it's E-I-F-F. Yeah, it was up there. E-I-F-F. Yeah, I was doing it right. I know. There's a T in fucking... Whatever that word is you said. What was it? Yeah! Yeah. Face it with two guys and a girl. One guy's getting hit from behind. And you guys are high-fiving each other. Ugh! You could also do a little bit of groundbreaking, but that's when you go with the brown eye instead. Why do they call it Brent groundbreaking? Because you're getting your dick in the mud. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Interesting. Mm-hmm. I like that mud. Get that butter. You're not afraid that to butter. put your tongue in that mud, though. I'm not. I, I am. I'm scared. I fucking lick a butthole. I'm scared. As long as, as long as the chick's fucking decently hot and I know she's fucking not smelling bad. Like, I don't just, like, go downstairs and be like... I don't know. I'm gonna just lick some butts. I think you do. <laughs> You're just like, my goals lick everybody's asshole tonight. I'm gonna lick your butt. I'm gonna lick your butt. And yours, Everyone and yours, listening, and yours, you're getting your butts licked. <laughs> Stop me in the street and I'll lick your butt cheeks, all right? <laughs> no, you can't lick their butt cheeks. You gotta lick that butthole. All right, I'll get the bong. I'll get yeah, it. That's right. I'll go, fucking, it. I'll go fucking tonsils deep. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I heard Emily hates you now. How? how is, yeah. What's up with that? Maybe, because, cause maybe I, she did Because I said her name on a podcast, apparently. Yeah, so I, I guess. Because I, I don't think we've ever really talked any I, kind I, of... Like, I think maybe one of the early ones... But I don't think her name got mentioned. I don't think either. I would have came up with a clever name that sounds exactly like it. Yeah. Like, Femily or something. <laughs> yeah. This is my friend Femily. Uh, this is my friend... Femily! Femily! Woo woo! Woo woo! <laughs> Fago! Fago? Makes, makes me feel good about that. I've tried Fago. It just tastes... It's not that great. Yeah, it's, it's just, just cheap like, soda. Yeah, it's just cheap soda. I was like, I'm really disappointed. Yeah, son, I'm disappointed that you're a juggalo. Is that feces coming out your pant leg? It is. You can really do is develop it. Huh. Develop your titties. Developers, 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 developers. Dude, Joaquin Noah he has face detrimental to the team. Look at his forehead. Look how, ah! I just want to punch his forehead. <laughs> I just want to punch his forehead over and over. He's a French monkey. Look at him. How does this guy get any pussy? Look at this motherfucker. Look how ridiculous he looks. Look at him. Look at him. Look at that kid in the background. I'm giving him the fucking people's eyebrow. I don't know. That wasn't people's eyebrow. No. Shift is is photobombing the cool thing to do now? I photobombed once. Did you? What'd you do? I didn't do it. I Go lied. On. I'm lying, internet. I'm lying about it. I just... I, I actually did one time. Uh, we were at uh, Swingers in Bloomington. Uh, I was with like the business people and our, my boss and my boss's boss and whatnot and we were at the table and there's another business party next to us and they asked the waitress if they could take a picture of them and, I'm, and my direct boss is like you should photo bomb them and I'm like okay <laughs> all right <laughs> <laughs> it's like like I wouldn't do it or something so I mean I didn't do anything crazy so usually when you say okay you're blatantly lying though what because like hey don't come inside me okay 
<laughs> yeah. Uh, so. I, I totally did do that to her. Yeah, it happens. Like, don't come inside me. Okay. okay. <laughs> you got it, dog. <laughs> Stone face killer style. Like, like just no, I, no. I was like, what? Well, who I, would do that? That's, I would not do that to you. This is this is Keith we're talking about here. Yeah, guys. I would come on. not. We would not. That. That's not my style. You're lucky you didn't get pregnant. Are you serious? I don't want to have no kids. <laughs> You're gonna get preggers if I have my way. If I have my way. Uh, I don't remember what we're talking about now. Uh, you photobombing? Wait. She sucker punches other girl basketball player. That's sweet. Damn, I'm digging it. Is there a video? Is There's a lesbian? video. Show. Oh shit. Show the video. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, oh, shit! She didn't even see it coming and got fucking laid out. Bam! I wonder what she did. Fucking prissy-ass blonde bitch. Probably deserved it. She's probably hot. Yeah. I try it out. Did she have a pancake butt? Did you waffle stomp it? <laughs> waffle stomper? Ouch. You burned me. What do you think about, uh... Sideway versus Rousey? Time. That no. happened, right? No, that's Zagano versus Rousey. No. I think Kat Zagano can beat her, depending on how she comes back from the knee injuries. She's she looks pretty fucking tough, and she's big for 135. But what do you think about daily at savings time? I like woke up this morning, and I, and I was gonna go to the gym at eight o'clock, and I did. But I was like, I woke up like I normally do, and I was like, oh my god, it's even closer to eight than normal. And I'm really tired. I like almost just roll over and said, fuck it. Yeah, like I'm freaking out right now because I'm mean, looking at the clock and see it's six and I look outside and the sun's still up and I'm like, yeah, like this is six. Illinois! This is fucking madness! Yeah, it's supposed <laughs> to be dark out. What, what's going on? I'm so drunk right now. I did so many lines. I did so All many the lines. Of coke. I'm going to just start dropping elbows on everything. I'll go skiing. Look, at, the, look at this. We only got one pull though. Eh, fuck it. I'll ski myself. <laughs> what am I? Spider Man. Spider Man. He shoots web on those bitches. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Spider Man mm -hmm. memes are the she uh. I don't know, dude. I dig it. <laughs> mm -hmm. I have the weirdest boner right now. Mm -hmm. My pillow has the weirdest boner right now. Shooting goo on people and stuff. They're all pretty clever. Like, I haven't really seen a bad one. This is bullshit. You can't ground Spider Man. I send this to people sometimes. My baggy detectors off the charts. Yeah. Actually, I just send them to TJ. <laughs> Dude, I hate today. I fuck bitches and got money. <laughs> oh, that's my favorite. That's my new faves. I'm posting that one. Post that shit. Dear Diary. Dear Diary. My life is a terrible spiral. But not like the good, awesome Nine Inch Nails album, Diamond Spiral? Nope. Oh. It's not good. I was going to look up something and I just forgot what it was. Is lesbians? Are we going to look up lesbians for research? You're going to excuse us if we get massive boners. Hmm. Well hung lesbians. That's not fake or anything. Why is that a picture of you? Why is that a picture of Britney's sister legitimately? <laughs> Where? Holy shit. <laughs> it's kind of weird. It bothers me how much she looks like Bieber. It's awkward. Like, my favorite kind of lesbian is yeah. not this kind of lesbian. Mine's like this. Yeah, two hot chicks. But those two chicks are always bisexual. They only do lesbian stuff to make... I do lesbian stuff. Yeah, yeah. I do too. Exclusively. We see your shit breaks. What is are she, we looking at? Is she pooping in the background? Is that what's going on? Oh, well, yeah. Hmm. But this is your type of chicks. Oh, yeah. Fat lesbians are my Fair favorite. There you go. There you go. They couldn't afford dildos, so they got McDicks. Yeah, they'd get this they got your dude. Egg, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Those chicks are faking it hard. Yeah, like I said, it's just not so believable. Hey, it's me. Good. No, you don't have your fucking makeup off. Aw, I'm not Gothopotamus. Yeah. Oh no, that's gross. Lesbian noobs. I don't get it. Because she's on a period. Wait a few days and try again. Yeah, but she would know that. She has one herself. I know. They would line up, too. That's pretty cool. What was I going to do? I don't even know. But yeah, we're looking at some awesome lesbian pictures here. And, um... <laughs> I approve. 
Right. Like I said, lipstick lesbians, the fake lesbians, the phase lesbians, like ones that are just like doing it to get the attention, or whatever. I'm down with that because they, at the end of the day, they're still gonna get the dick. But actual lesbians, I got no use for them. I don't have any problem with them, and I might even let a lesbian be my wingman. But I will put my wee wee in their butt. My wee wee in their woo woo. There you go. Uh, I don't think society thinks that. No. That's lame. This topic's stupid. Yep, lesbians. Why did you come up with this topic? I don't know. I thought lesbians would uh, have us like an infinite amount of stuff to talk about, but I just really don't have any strong feelings about lesbians. I have a strong feeling. In my pants? Yeah. Like exclusively in my <laughs> pants? <laughs> no, that's weak sauce. Aww. Man, I really wish I could remember what I was going to look up. It was like something in mildly important. Was it profound? No. Was but it, it, like- was, it was something like relevant to talk about. Uh, relevant? Revelant? Relevant? Rev- Is revelant a word? I don't think so. Okay, I like making up words. Sweet! That's a good strategy. How about the Eagles this summer? How do you how, how do you think they're going to be? Uh, where, what would you like to see the Eagles uh, draft? A uh, draft? A <laughs> draft? I would like to see them uh, fix their defense the, in the draft. The three Fs. Fago, family, and whoop whoop. Yep, those are the three <laughs> Fs. <laughs> I'm good at this. I would like the Eagles to draft uh, defense. I really would. I'd like to see that happen. But uh, Chip Kelly's like, what the fuck's defense? So. Oh, man, my pitch week. Well, you've been working out and shit. I know. Still. It was the heat of the moment. <laughs> do, 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 heat of the... Why do you have a picture, a frame picture of Asia? It's an awesome song. <sighs> oh, it's in June. That's one of this. June! Are you going to go up there and fucking own, own some noobs? No, probably not. Noob cakes! What I'm going to do is, I bought some stuff off this one guy for, What's like... drugs? Well, Wait, did you get your like, sweet sleeves? My ones. The ones that you ordered last time. The, I didn't order them. Oh, I thought you did. No, the panda ones? Yeah. No, I haven't ordered them yet. Aw. This is, yeah, this is what my shit looks like. It's pretty sweet. I, I'm waiting for another uh, pack of sleeves of the one, other, of another kind to come in stock. Before I do, uh, are you buying them from Wizards of the one? Coast? Are no. they wizard sleeves? No, these are Star Cities. <laughs> oh God, I just got what you meant. That's gross. <laughs> yeah. No, these ones. Yeah, those are cool. These. Yeah, those those are fucking dope. I'm buying two packs of them. Two packs. Look at that. That's gonna be my play mat. How fucking cool is that? It's like, oh, look at those little fucking little, 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 little guys. guys. They're gonna be distracted by your cuteness. I know. That's what I'm hoping for. Cute is what we aim for. Isn't that a metal band? No, I think it's a song. No, I think it's a band. I think it's a song. Type it in. Okay. Cute is what we aim for is a Christian metal band. Are you sure? <laughs> oh, they're right, it is. I don't know about Christian metal band. Are they even metal, though? Because that know. guy doesn't look very metal. He looks I like fucking is. Spicoli from he looks, fucking Fat Time to Rich High. He looks, he looks <laughs> better than Drake Parker from fucking the... Uh, uh, God, uh... What's up, man? Hey, dudes, are oh, you ready? Chunk, no Captain yeah, Chunk? Yeah, Chunk, no Captain Chunk. <laughs> that guy totally looks like Drake from that Drake and Josh show. Wow, this is, uh, this is uh, Christian hardcore. <laughs> True story. Um, Cutest what we aim for does not get the podcast seal of approval. <laughs> no, it, no, it doesn't. Every time I die, it's going to be a Warped Tour. Oh, uh, TJ told me to ask you if you're going to go to Warped Tour this year. I, I want to go to Warped Tour this That's year. That's what I was going to do. I was going to look up the Warped Tour list. But see. also, uh, did you... I don't know if we talked about this, but as a lay dying singer, pleading guilty to Yeah, fucking, he's going to be in prison for a long time. That's fucking cool. But uh, as I was saying... Uh, he's an Austrian death machine. I, I agreed to buy some cars from this one dude for 2.7 thousand. Yeah, 2.7. Damn. Uh, these are all buy list prices. However... Some of these are under buy list prices, like the site that I would sell them to. So partly uh, the reason I'm going to go to Chicago, in addition to playing, I'm going to try to sell everything I don't need that I bought from my guy and make and, a fucking fat profits and make and make a fucking like two, like two point seven higher obviously profit. So I'll get like I'm hoping to get at least three five for it and flip it for eight hundred dollars. Yeah, you probably could, especially there because people yeah. are going to be. Oh yeah, there's sell- there's crazy sellers and all that shit. And so, like, some of these cards are going to go up even more by then, by June. Mm-hmm. But, uh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. like, 
in, in my price listing, almost all the five dollar cards or cards under seven seven dollars and under most of them, I'd even price them of the cards I bought from them. So even the fucking like fucking seven dollar cards and under, I didn't price those. So that's just all this extra cash on top of the big money cards I'm going to be selling. Like I'm going to keep some of these, some of them. Yeah, obviously. But like some of these man mm -hmm. are just all like fucking straight profit. Because the decks I'm going to be playing in Modern and Legacy, I pretty much already have, except for a few cards. And I'll use that money and change and keep keep most of it and keep most of the money and uh, get what I need for my two decks. And those two, the Legacy deck will never go out. It'll always be the same deck forever. So I'll never have to fucking buy any cards again for that shit, except for Standard, really. It's badass. Yeah. So, like, it's all kind of profit. And yeah. I'll never need to build other decks for those formats, really. So as long as you can uh, find people willing to buy... But you should be able to, especially oh, yeah. at a place like that. Well, you, even on. even at a smaller event, uh, this one guy I know, he sold like a bunch of his old standard crap that he doesn't even use for any other formats now for like two hundred. Yeah, you could get really lucky, and one of some of the cards you have there could be used in winning decks, and people will be all over that shit. Oh, and, and immediately I'm, skyrocket the value. I'm hoping in the mean, there's no really sets. I don't think come out until a little bit before that. But in the meantime, like all the cards on here. That I'm gonna be getting rid of, or hot. Like some of these fetch lands I have are gonna be hot forever. And like this, this one for example. Let's see. It's uh. Let's see, they're they're selling. They're selling it for. What? It's up that high? Because of the modern tournaments, it might go back down. But they're selling it for one copy for a hundred dollars. That means they're buying for at least fifty. Damn. I'm I'm paying to buy it. For let's see, I'm I'm buying it for forty five. Turning around, selling it for at least fifty. I mean, it's five dollars, but but still, this okay, is man. cumulative on all these. Exactly. Like you can't you don't look at the small picture. It's gonna yeah. be after you sell everything, how much yeah. you're gonna come yeah, out. Yeah, exactly. With. Like, uh, let's see, what's what's another one? Um, keeping those, can't sell that. Um. Doo -doo 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 in the meantime, let's start talking about the Warped Tour list. Okay. Well, uh, I want to see a Skylit Drive. Jesse said he might even go to see Anne Berlin. Hmm. Did you hear about his car got DUI? Really? Uh, he let he, he drove some drunk people home and their car and let his roommate and a couple other people drive his, his vehicle. They fucking told the son of a bitch. So he doesn't uh, have a car right now. That sucks. Yeah. And uh, I was talking to him, I'm like, are you going to go to Warped Tour? He's like... I can't. It's going to be too expensive. I'm like, you know it's only $45. He's like, really? I'm like, yeah. Now, when is Warped? Uh, July 19th. Is that on a weekend? Saturday. Okay, then we're good. Okay, that was the only thing that yeah. would be standing yeah. away. Okay, so we got... A lot like birds. I don't know. Like some of these, I don't know. I don't. I, I don't know some of these bands. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna you, do. You read off the bands. We'll do a we'll do a, a warp we'll, tour uh, rundown. See, here. see who we've heard of and who we like and whatnot. All right. The first band on this list is uh, a lot like birds. Apparently, they are hardcore and rock. So I'm assuming they're probably also Christians. Yeah. I've never heard of them though. Okay. Okay. Uh, a Skylit Drive, rock and hardcore. I like a Skylit Drive. So. And honestly, it might even be bad. Straight up, switching topics real quick. These guys, if I sell, I, I think if I sold them straight out for cash, I would get less value. These guys give me, uh, they, you can get cash or you can get, they keep your stuff and you get 30% on top of it, which might actually be better just to fucking yeah. send a massive amount to them and just be fucking, just buy the cards I need from them and just be done with it. Cause like I was trying to buy a, let's see, uh, this card, they, they sell it for, they turn around and sell it for uh, 400 but they buy it 200 and I was going to try to get them for 325 for two of them. So I would eventually come out and get three regular versions of that for two foils of that and 50 bucks. So the, my net profit would be I spent 75 I saved $75 and got three more ahead. But I, I didn't end up winning because the people paid fucking really crazy for yeah. it. But I was trying to do that. So I'm thinking about actually not doing that and selling all this shit to these guys. And, and seeing what I come out to. Yeah, because, I mean, if you can get a better deal. Because I get, I get that amount of money and 30% on top. Yeah, you got to set your floor. Like, decide what you want to make as your your absolute minimum profit. You know yeah. what I mean? And then, like, then break it down that way. Yeah. Cause if you can get it, then fucking get it. Yeah, because, I mean, there's there's so much on here I don't even need, really. 
it's nice to have these extras and stuff, but I'm better off just getting cards like, maybe not this foil version, but that version, just because I'm going to be playing it in my modern and my legacy deck, and I need four copies, and I can't seem to fucking get four. So it's like, you know... But, I mean, if I can come up and actually get the copies of what I need, like these, if I win that shit, I won't need the money, then I can just sell for straight cash. It just depends on, like, where I am by then. And these are going through the roof. These are almost up to 190 for one right now. Yeah. Damn. That, that's what they're selling on these websites for. And they're just going up. So it's like, you know, I'm better off selling and trying to get credit. But, uh, yeah, okay, back to the bands. Go ahead. All right. Okay, a Skylar Drive. I know. I want to see. I don't. Uh, I don't know any of their songs. Air Dubai. I don't know. Hip hop. They're. I don't know. I don't know. Alive like me. Never heard of them. Nope. And Berlin. I've never heard of. I've I've heard of them. I don't know their songs. I listened to one. It was like nothing. Nothing that would make me listen to it again. Attila. I like. They're pretty I, heavy. I didn't like it. I don't remember. I remember not liking Attila. Bad Rabbits, they're R&B, so they've some sweet slow jams. <laughs> That's what I'm coming for. Yeah, Beartooth. I think I listened to I listened to one of my songs earlier, and it seemed kind of heavy. Uh, there's a ska band there, Beebs and her Moneymakers. Yeah, they were, the chick was asking her, uh, the crowd last time when we walked by last summer, uh, for guys to whip out their dicks, because she wanted to see some penises. I would whip out my dick. What'd if you? she asked this year, I will fucking do it. Okay, I just don't want to be there when you do even it. If, even if I get kicked out of Warped Tour, it'll be worth it. Born of Osiris, they're pretty heavy. Yeah, I like Born of Osiris. Born for Soup. I, I like what? Born for Soup. I like their singles. You might be kind of close to that, by the way. Uh, Breathe Carolina. I don't really like Breathe Carolina. I, I like their singles. I know Adam really does. Uh, I like their singles. I don't know the rest of their songs, and I'm going to assume they're bad live because they're that electronic kind of band. Chelsea Grin. I like Chelsea Grin. I remember not liking them. Uh, Chunk No Captain Chunk, obviously. Uh, I like them. I mean, I don't dislike them. They're, I'm not going to go out of my way to see them. Yeah. Courage, my love. Uh, I think they're just like pop mostly. Yeah, pop, pop punk. punk. Crown the Empire. I like the song I heard by them. I didn't really check it out too hard. Cute is what we aim for. Obviously, no. did not get the seal of approval. Did not get it. Did not. Uh, Danger Kids. I don't know. They're like a rock hip hop fusion group. Where? Danger Kids. And don't da know. Day Show. I don't, don't know. know. DJ Nicola Bear. Don't. Echo Smith. Nope. Nope. They officially list themselves as indie. That, they're not indie if you've yeah if you've heard of them yeah exactly uh, TJ's been really talking about Inner Shikari a lot like punk, he says uh, he's really into an electronic now. punk band hmm. yeah they're different have you heard of them before mm -mm. I'll, I'll play you a song after the podcast every time I die we saw them live and they were terrible I, live but I blame it was the sound it was dude. the sound was, system I, yeah it'll be outdoor I think they'll be better this time yeah Falling in Reverse I like Falling in Reverse, yeah, I, like Falling I, would, reverse. I would watch them I don't know this For all those sleeping I've heard a song by them And I can't remember If I liked it or not I don't think it made Much of an impression on me yeah. uh, For Today I'm not really big Into Metalcore uh, I don't really know them Get scared I heard they're good Yeah But it's they're Apparently they're rock So we're gonna have to Listen to them Also after mm -hmm. Heart to Heart I Fight Dragons I the Mighty uh, I, heard, I, heard these, I heard these guys are good. I yeah, Ice Nine true. Kills is good. I like them. Issues. He's, issues is on tour right now with Bring Me the Horizon. That's legitimately my favorite Korn album. They're, they're, <laughs> they're, they're on tour with Bring Me the Horizon, which all the bands that are touring with Bring Me the Horizon are actually, I believe, on this tour. Wait, let me see. Except for Bring Me the Horizon? Wait, is Of Mice and Men on here? Or wait, no, they're not touring with Mice and Who are they returning with? No, yeah, they are. Of, of Mice and Men. But I, I don't see them, them on here. Yeah. Okay, anyway. Less Than Jake? We saw them. I, I didn't. I didn't like that stuff so much a couple years ago, but now I listen to it and I kind of like it. Now. Maybe you're uh, getting a ska in your uh, old age. I did. I didn't mind this. Oh, hey, hey look. Hey. Yeah. Maybe Pray probably does really good covers. I don't know if I would like to see them live. Yeah, I like their covers too. MC Chris. Oh, that's just ridiculous. I fucking love MC Chris. You don't watch him then? I'll fucking go check him out, dude. If All he's right, gonna cool, be there. Cool. No, no, I don't no, know. Mixed mixed motionless and white. We gotta see those motherfuckers, dude. I heard they're good. I don't know if they're good live. They're playing the castle Monday night. Really? Yeah. Damn. Twenty one and over show. I wish I would have known. I fucking I, love motionless I, I, and white. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I would definitely go. Uh, neck deep. I don't know. Don't know. Nick grit. See, it seems like this sh warp tour has become less about punk. punk and more about like heavy metal. Yeah, well, because it's kind shit. of the new punk, like really. It's, it's kind. Of, I don't know. I don't really care for that much that stuff. One OK Rock. Pacific Dub, Parkway Drive, Plague Vendor. Like this one? Like this one right here? 
I'm buying. I bought those. But I value them at 100. They're selling for 120 at, at the moment. So by the time I go to sell them, they might be up on more. So that's like sixty dollars profit right there buying those three because I'm not going to keep them. Yeah, say so if you can turn that profit, man, turn that profit. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But at the same time, it's like, how long do I want to hold on to them? Because I know they're going to go infinitely up. Yeah. You know? Well, you got to decide, man, because you yeah. don't want the shit to fucking break down. Because like in the next set, they can release a card that like they're, they're never going to replant those ever. They've they said that they'll never do that again. Well, I mean, I mean, they make 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 a card that makes it useless or something. You just never know. No, they're lands. Land, lands don't fall under that rule. What if the entire fucking next set is just land destruction? It doesn't matter. It, it won't make it into that format. It's too slow. And there's other ways to get around it. All right, Nick Grit, never heard of him. One OK Rock, never heard of it. Rock and emo. They're emo, so probably yeah. not good. We, we lost Hawthorne Heights last year. There's a lot of girls there. Oh yeah, for sure. I love there's, emo there's gonna chicks. be a lot of there's gonna be a lot of emo chicks watching Falling in Reverse as well. Pacific Dub. Parkway Drive. Yeah, it's probably playing that way. I know, but it's probably going to be really loud. That's what I'm saying. Like, well, kind of close to it. It might not be good at all if I'm back here, though. Like, I, 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 I think, was thinking about that. Because, like, that's, this, is, this is where it was in the second video, too. This is where yeah, I was. Yeah, but I, I think in the second video, I was also playing a lot more songs. And mm -hmm. kind of distorted it. But because we didn't do anything different. And you sat there last time. And it sounded fine the first time. Okay. Parkway Drive. I've heard of them. Yeah. I don't. I'm. I they, think they're a heavy band. I don't really know much else about them. Yeah, they didn't really make an impression on me. Plague vendor. I don't know. No. Purvis. Purvis. Per. I think it's Purvis. Purvis. Ah, uh, maybe. Don't know. Purvis Ellison. He's a basketball player. Real friends. I listen to their songs. They're fucking terrible. Yep. Their lead singer wears a sweater. <laughs> He's. His glasses. <laughs> the bass player wears glasses. The drummer's a girl. <laughs> All right. Saves the day. I've heard of them, and they, uh, I'm not really a big fan of secrets. them. Secrets. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know a lot of people this year, apparently. State champs. Uh, Raven Press. Survive this. Tear out the heart. My friend Marcus really likes this band. Teenage Bottle Rocket. Yeah. Well, they're a punk band. Yeah, so. they're they're just ravage punk band. Terror. I know Terror. They're fucking. They're old school hardcore yep, bands. One of the original hardcore bands. Color Morale. I don't know. I know. Devil Wars Prada. I heard it's good live. I'm not a real big fan of them. Me, yeah, same here. These guys are really hardcore live. The Ghost Inside. Yeah. The Main. I don't know them. They're like a fucking girl band. You know, like girls like yeah. them. The Proto dude. Men. Dude, I posted. I, I gave the Proto Men some props a few years ago when I was doing my top horrorcore bands. Really? Yeah, they, I posted one of their videos because they're like a monster rock group. The Ready Set. I don't know them. Do you? Uh, I've heard of them, but not, I've never listened to them. The story so far, the I summer set. I wonder if they feud with the ready set. No, dude, uh, the summer set, I like one of their songs, if it's who I'm thinking of. Let me see. I think they were on last year. Yeah, they were They were on last year. You were, Oh, yeah, you were right there. I went there. Uh, we we were, we walked by while they were doing their set right before Bring Me the Horizon came on. And so we watched Bring Me the Horizon. But I wish Bring Me the Horizon was going to be there. You, you've heard of this band. I know you have. You know the song. Or at least I've heard it. This is a sweet Amazon jam. Yeah. Uh, let's see. The Word Alive, they're a heavy band. I don't know them. Yeah, I know them. TJ talks about them being good. Watsky's going to be there and Wax. Oh, Wax we got to see Wax, dude. I know. Wax is fucking Wax tight. is the shit. Not getting enough props. Wax is one of the yeah. fucking freshest MCs out there. Hells yeah. Here you go. Yeah, I've heard this song. Yeah, that's the summer set. I like that song. You would. I know. I would. We are in the crowd. Yellow card. Yellow card's one of the old school punk bands coming back to play it. Do you know Vanna? Nope. This wildlife to the wind. We the Kings. I Is heard of We the, the Kings? Kings. What song do they do? Didn't they do used to do a song that was popular way back then? Maybe. Oh, actually shows what dates everybody's gonna be there now. In case they're like missing a date or whatever. Tenley Bar. Yeah, see July nineteenth, Saturday. Usually it's on the twentieth. But uh. Yeah, so that's that's the rock. Oh yeah, volumes. They play really good live. They're a heavy band. They play good live. That's all uh, I care about, man. Like I'll give every. I'm willing to give everyone a fair shake, even if they don't make music that I, I don't like. Maybe they're good live. Cause uh, when I went to Mayhem Fest, uh, I had, I was never really a big As I Lay Dying fan, and they were fucking crazy awesome live. Yeah. And uh, there's another band that was there that I can't I can't remember. Uh, well, we're almost at an hour already. Yeah. But I can't remember what the fucking name of the band is now, but they were really awesome live. But then I listened to them; they're like a death metal band. It sounded terrible. Ooh. I can't remember it. I just said that. <laughs> it's pretty obvious that I wasn't listening. Yeah. Who? 
Uh, I think their name is <laughs> Fuck You Keith. <laughs> Listen, you fucking douche. <laughs> I'm gonna make They're it. a very specific anti-Keith band. <laughs> Can you blame them? They're probably Christian hardcore. Yeah. That's my favorite kind of music is Christian hardcore. Oh, Whitechapel. Whitechapel is the band. Oh, really? Yeah, and Whitechapel, like, they're really awesome live. They don't sound anything like they do on the records. Like, they, they sound like a, like a hardcore band Holy live. Fuck. They're buying that for 70 right now, and I'm buying mine for 45 It's at, like, a $35 profit right now at this second. But also, Modern has been... Is it a GP... Or a pro tour, and now the GP, so I'm, it might got back, go back down because I don't think there's another modern event for a little while. Yeah, so what do you think? I mean, what's your initial thoughts of Warp Tour right now? Um, like, I'm thinking that it's going to be a Warp Tour of Discovery. Like, yeah. Because I don't know a lot of bands. we're going to have to listen to some songs about yeah, these bands. Yeah, there are a couple know. bands that I really want to see that are going to be there that I'm like, like for sure. Who, who do you want to see that's currently on there? Like, like I, I want to see Wax. Okay. I, I would like to see MC Chris. Okay. Uh, a Skylet Drive, I would like to see. I don't know. Uh, okay. Falling in Reverse, I, I want to see. Yeah. Um, there was a couple other ones I, I can't remember like who's out, but a, a couple of definitely piqued my interest. Hmm. But there are some there that I would like to see. Hopefully they're not playing at the same time. Yeah, that that sucks sometimes when that happens, but that's just kind of what it is, really. It's 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 pretty unavoidable to be honest. Yeah, like if it comes down to it, like I'll watch the beginning of one show and the end of another. You know what I mean? Like just so I can get them both in. But. Yeah. And this one, this year, I won't feel like I'm gonna die out in the fucking heat. You're gonna die. I'll probably die eventually, but. Ooh, that that might not work out in my favor because, uh, that date then, a month after is the monitor, so the prices might be up by the time. Got some. Let's see. Who do I want to see? Who do I want to see? Um. This isn't looking like a very good year for me. I wouldn't mind watching Bowling for Soup and Breathe Carolina. I'm not going to actively see him. I'll probably watch Chunk, No Cap and Chunk. Yeah, just because like, that's such a fucking running yeah, joke. Yeah. That's like, uh, I might go watch Crown the Empire. Uh, I'm definitely going to watch Falling in Reverse. Yeah, Falling in Reverse is one of them that uh, I want to see. I might give Every Time I Die another a shot since it was pretty unfair. Yeah, I, I, feel, I think we should definitely. Because, I, I mean, first of all, they were never going to add up anyway because they were yeah. playing with Gore. Yeah, um, every, yeah I agree. Uh, I might watch Inner Shikari. Um, I'm probably gonna watch Less Than Jake because Norman's gonna. Oh, Motionless and White, duh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch Motionless and White. Uh, we're probably gonna have to watch Less Than Jake. Yeah, and that's fine. I like I mean, we actually we split up a bunch last year. Yeah. This, this past year, and we all went watch who we wanted to watch. Like, and just uh, meet up places. Yeah, I, I, I mean, we have phones, so it's not as hard. You know? Yeah. And like, I, we got some food and we hung out on the amphitheater and like watched a bunch of bands that we're gonna play because Norman wanted to see a couple and it just so happened that we want to sit down for a second and eat some food. So, like, watch, like, Hawthorne Heights and Silverstein and somebody else. A couple other ones. Um, let's see. What else we got in here? I might watch Teenage Bottle Rocket, but probably not. I would unless, like my, unless my friend Marcus comes. I would like to see the Proto Men just because, like, I bet you they put on an awesome show. They're going to probably be in the amphitheater, I would bet. Yeah. Look, rock and opera. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't really care about that. Was where's process? Nah. I don't mind if I don't see him. Uh, we're gonna watch volumes. I can guarantee you. Okay, I'll check they, out volumes. They they do good live. I have I've never really listened to them much, like otherwise. But live they were good. There's one more I wanted to think I wanted to watch. Wax. Oh, yeah, I want to watch Wax. Uh, the Ghost Inside. I, I want to see them because I heard they fucking pretty hardcore live. I think it'd be cool to see Terror also just because yeah, of like their old, their old school hardcore yeah. band. This is gonna be people getting punched in the fucking face. Oh yeah, uh, we were watching volumes last year, and uh, Norman's like, "I'm gonna go get in the pit," and I'm like, "I'll just hang out here because I was really close to the stage. We were really close to the stage." TJ was on the railing, and I was like, like two people behind him, and uh, Norman's like, "I'm gonna go get in the pit," and I was like, "I'm just gonna stay here since we're close." He's like, "All right." So he comes, and like, not but like five seconds later, he comes back, like holding his face. I'm like, "What happened?" He's like, "Some guy just fucking punched me in the face." So I got out of the pit. I'm like, that sucks, yeah, dude. Yeah, I'm like, that sucks, dude. The pit. Uh, yeah. So you got out, like, and say, I'm like, did you punch him back? He's like, no, that fucking kid ran away. <laughs> and I was like, I don't think he probably ran away. No, probably not. But Norman's just not confrontational. Yeah. It's all good, though. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's your style. That's your style. I ain't gonna fucking get on your nuts about it. Yeah, I don't know. There's a lot of, there's a lot of unknown people. Yeah. But like, I guess it was like, 
It was kind of like that the first time we went. I didn't really know a lot of the bands the first time we went. Yeah, like, like that's when we found What Was Me. Yeah, and What Was Me was fucking awesome. But they broke up now, which sucks. I know, that really sucks. Yeah. At least you got to see them, though, before they fucking broke up. I got to see them twice. Boop, boop. Fago. Family. Family. <laughs> yeah, so, uh... Yeah, that's our Warp Tour fucking preview. Warp we'll, Tour preview, baby. I mean, we'll have a breakdown after Warp Tour, obviously. Of like yeah, what we it'll liked. be. Actually, it's the fucking. We'll have it literally the day after Warp mm-hmm. Tour. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, we mm-hmm. might, uh, on the way back home, like film some in the car, too. Just get our initial right after the Warp Tour thoughts. Oh, you could. That's a good idea. Yeah. Definitely can't bring the camera in there, though. Cause well, I, I would not. Yeah, because I think you'll get it taken I, away. No. It, it's really nice that you can bring bottles of water in there, dude. It is so fucking helpful. Like. Yeah, because the water there water. costs like fucking like ten fifty. It, it's not even about the money, but like being able to bring your own water bottle with a cap in it and shit, you can just get refills all day. It made it so much fucking better. Yeah, because you just get the water fountain, right? Exactly. It made it so much better, dude. It's not about the money, money, money. What's that? It's a song. By who? Uh, maybe Selena Gomez. <laughs> I don't know. Are you sure? I don't know. Just type in it's not about the money. Alright, hold on, I'm gonna... That's blatantly not what you tried to... This, this, this is gonna be the outro. Alright. In, in a few minutes. Or... Fuck it. Sick. We might as well end it now, because we right. are well over an hour. Alright, here you go. Here's the outro song. Alright. Well, get you motherfuckers on the flip. Peace out. In a second. Once it starts. Good job. Oh, Good. shit. I fucked it up. You did. I'm an idiot. What? I'm like, shouldn't she be saying something about single ladies right now? <laughs> Peace out, bitches. Peace out, nugs. Hurry up, family, Fago, and